uh, we're going to definitely get into your dad and, and just basically talk about the, uh, the documentary. So I'm headed to Mount Olive Cemetery, Slim's final resting place, to meet up with his son, Lil Soldier Slim. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. Man, we back on the set, man. And my guy, he's here once again, man. This guy right here, man, he is uh, uh, the extra co-host. I was just about to say you the new that? co-host. The new co-host, man. He, the, he back in town, man. Little Soldier Slim's in the building. What's going on? What's up, fam? Man, man so... Uh, this time, we, I, I wanted to just, uh, we're going to definitely get into your dad and, and just basically talk about the uh, the documentary. So I'm headed to Mount Olive Cemetery, Slim's final resting place, to meet up with his son, Lil Soldier Slim. Yeah, yeah, because I was so curious about that because I know that one thing I noticed that 50, it ain't seem like it's always 50 Cent who's always doing it, which I applaud him for that because... From him doing BMF and, you know, it seemed like he's reaching out to all these kids of OGs, whether passed away or not, or locked up. He's trying to put out their legacy. He's trying to put out their stories. Yeah. And I love that. And I applaud him for that. Like, I really, I really, when they came to me with the idea, I was, I was excited about it. And I just reached out to my auntie and was putting them on game. How did it, how did it, just, just run me down the road of how he even, how they even. Yeah, who which, reached out? Um... Man, this lady. Um, How long ago? This was like January. Oh, so this is really quick. It happened really quick. Yeah, we filmed maybe April. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And when did it get finished? Um, Man, we filmed. Well, they filmed for like three, four days. And that was just that. That's it? In New Orleans? Yeah, they came to New Orleans. They was locked in. That's quick. Like, they came and locked in. Like, they organized it before they came mm-hmm. and clamped on it. Mm. Yeah. Wow. Was 50 out there too? No, it was um the guy from TMZ, what his name is. He's earned a rep on the mic and in the streets. And I'm hoping he can offer some clarity about who may have ordered his father's killing. Which one? There's a whole you talking um, the 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 head guy? Man, I used to follow him. I can't think of his name right now. I don't want to mess it up. But he he he's somebody important. <laughs> you know, so, I ain't gonna act like he's not. But no, it's not the head guy, the um, the one who's always narrating and talking. Is it him? Uh, uh um, he he used to narrate a lot of these stuff though. Okay, so he's not the same one. Yeah. Okay, yeah. So when you first um, when you when you when you first was approached with it, they told you you're gonna have to be in New Orleans for four days, or they did a week. I ain't had to be out there. I just did mine. You know what I'm saying? Probably three hours. Yeah. That's it? And then they, yeah, then they went around to other people. Other people. They would they just sit you down and just kind of ask you questions about, like, kind of what we do, ask you about what you remember? Well, it wasn't like this. Um, we went to the grave, and we walked around the grave, you know? I appreciate you talking with us today, bro. Sure, bro. Yeah. What has it been like not having your father around? Yeah. Walked around the grave. No, right? the grave is there. It, it's a walk in and walk. The one that I seen is that the grave where it's you walk in, in and it's walls and yeah, stuff. Yeah, but it's a, it's also a, the same grave yard. Like they have a yard. Okay. So we walked around the yard and then we walked up. You know. Well, what's in the, the just the base? Just the remembrances of him. What? The where they got the soldier rag hanging, the bullet hanging out of the deal. Was put it was in the wall. Yeah. It's a casket, but I thought it was. I thought it was. It ain't a great. It ain't a grave one as well. Like where uh-uh. I was on the ground. Okay, uh-uh. just in the wall. Uh, yeah, that's cr- that's that's different. Yeah. Wow. How long? And and do you have other relatives out there? Um, I know I know other people that's there. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So you've been going there all your life. Yeah. I mean, ever since uh, of you were eight. Yeah. 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 And um, with the documentary, I know a lot of times when people think about a documentary. Like for me, I think about a movie might be coming soon. Have any talks been going on about maybe a movie coming out about him, or um, like pe- a series or anything like pe- that? People be kind of asking about it. Um, that's something that I like to do on my own, honestly. Okay. You know, I like to put my own money into it and do it how I would want it, want it to be done, mm-hmm. versus bringing in investors unless the, unless it's fully just them putting their money in and let me do what I want to do. Mm-hmm. You no. Know? Did was it planned that like cause he died on November the twenty sixth, right? So was it planned to do it on this month because this was the month he died? No, it's just falling like that. Yeah, they wow. series just was 
set up the launch this month. That's hard. That, that's you know, like when we met, we we met on his birthday. Mm -hmm. So it's kind of stuff that kind of mm -hmm. like like pretty much it's confirmation that you're doing what you should be doing, mm -hmm. right? Right? When you start seeing things fall the way it should fall. Yeah, we on Boss Talk One on One. Yeah, we gonna talk.